What's up you guys? Welcome back to Limitless Trading. My name is Jonathan and thank you for stopping by today. Today I would like to ask a question. The question is, is it time to trade Virgin Galactic Space? First thing I want to do is take a second to thank each and all of you for your support. Your comments really help a lot. They inspire me to keep improving and keep providing new content. If you've not yet subscribed to the channel and would like to help me out, please take a second and click the subscribe button down below. And if you would also like to leave a like rating, go ahead and do that now. I'd like to reach out to uh, two recent commenters and say thank you for your comments on the ride video. I really appreciate the feedback. Uh, it really helps out in improving the content. Thanks again. Again, today I want to talk about Virgin Galactic as a potential trade. I want to make it clear that this is not an investment idea, it's a trade idea, and it's just my own trading plan. Let's jump into the setup. Space was up uh, more than $5 last week on the news of a scheduled test flight. As uh, Reuters reports here, uh, Virgin Galactic moves closer to uh, space tourism because of this completed test flight. This test flight took place on May 22nd and was successful. This was the impetus for my uh, space trade idea. The news that came out last week, the test flight that was scheduled and the success that it had. Now I want to talk about the thesis I'm playing with and get your take. The stock is showing a very nice reward to risk ratio because it is much closer to the support level at the bottom around 15 than it is to the resistance level closer to 33. Additionally, the 52 week high of 60 per share in February during the Reddit inspired short squeeze shows that there's uh, room to go to the top side. The 52 week low, uh, which has reached multiple times and is as I, I consider long term support is around $15 per share. Now I want to move on to the due diligence aspect. Each of you should all do your own due diligence due diligence before making any trade. So, point one, Space is a pre-revenue company. What that means is they don't yet have revenue, uh, but that is looking to change as they are moving closer and closer towards commercial space tourism. Forbes reports that over 600 future customers have already completed, have already put down deposits to secure their seat on a future flight. And as I've already stated here, on May 22nd, Space had a Space Virgin Galactic had a very had a very successful test flight in which they reached Mach 3 and reached an altitude of more than 55 miles or 88 and a half kilometers above the surface of the Earth. This is the distance or the elevation that NASA recognizes as space. These are all positive messages for me leading me to have a reasonably good feeling after my due diligence. I find risk management to be the most important part of trading, and let's jump into that now. I prefer to keep my position sizes very small, meaning risk of less than 2%, between 1% to 2% in each position. I envision a stop at around 15 because this is the long-term support level that has been tested and held up multiple times throughout the last year. My price target is not $60 per share. It's not the all-time high. My price target here is around $35 per share, which is something that was previously reached in March during its last rebound. Now, it's currently trading at 21 if we look at the stock. If we look at the chart down here in the bottom right, what I would like to see is during intraday trading on Monday, maybe it pulled back around 20. I'd like to see that as an entry. I envision this as a swing trade, not as a day trade or an investment. What I mean there is that I had measured the time in this trade with weeks and maybe days, definitely not hours and definitely not months. What's your take on space, Virgin Galactic? Is it a buy, a sell, or do you just want to stay away from it? Thanks for joining me today as I walk you through my Virgin Galactic uh, trade idea. Until next time, I'm Jonathan with Limitless Trading. Goodbye.